singing background remains a, I suppose, a somewhat unheralded position. You know. He gave us free reign, and everybody's face would light up, you know. I probably interviewed 65 backup singers. I spent a lot of time getting to know backup singers. They're not stars. I've got dreams. Dream. I felt like if I just gave my heart Remember. to what I was doing, I would automatically be a star. Well, when you're singing background, you may have to pay an agent for getting you a gig, but that's all you have to pay. And you take your paycheck and you press on. You know, sometimes it's easier, but when you when you when you're strong. Story. When you're a backup singer, it is a springboard, but it can easily become quicksand if that's not what you want to do. It's a bit of a walk. That walk to the front is, is is complicated. I mean, there's so many things that can easily set off the reason why they're not on front and center and why they're singing behind. Um, and, and it's not because it's just they can't sing it. It's like there's so many things. I think people whose egos really couldn't handle this business didn't last. They washed out because they couldn't take it. And I, there are a lot of people who like that. But the people that actually had careers, I think, were able to come to some kind of a peace with themselves. So I feel like at the end of the day, they've all struggled with it maybe, but they've, they're proud of what they've done. And, you know, even though there might be some restlessness and, you know, hopefully now, Maybe they'll they'll get that credit. Believe.